Hey everybody, this is Anthony Rocco with Appliance Buyer's Guide. Today we're going to talk about clear ice makers for the home and which models are the quietest. Okay, so this question is really um, one that I just got via email the other day and, and one that I've gotten in the past many times, so I thought it was probably a good um, basis for a video. Um, customer says, you know, my wife hates the noise that our ice maker makes currently. We're building a new house. We need a new ice maker. Which model is the quietest? Asking what's the quietest model clear ice maker on the market is kind of like asking what's the quietest shotgun you can buy. They're all going to make some noise. It's kind of inherent in the design of, uh, of the product. Um, clear ice makers, when we say clear ice makers, what we're usually talking about is either a 15 inch wide under counter or an 18 inch wide under counter unit for a kitchen or bar area or outdoor area. These are machines that are constantly making ice. They never stop making ice because as they make ice, the ice drops down into the bin and then as the ice sits in the bin, you know, the, the oldest ice starts to melt and then there's a pump that usually pumps out um, any of the, the melted ice so that it's always kind of dry in there. So when we're talking about clear ice, we're talking about that, and that's machines by like Perlick, Sub-Zero, Hoshisaki, uh, GE, KitchenAid, you know, uh, you name it. Pretty much anybody that's calling the ice that they make clear ice is using a machine in that function. Um, and these machines, the way that they work is, and, and, the, and the noise that they make is from three different, pro, you know, phases in the machine. The first phase is the, the ice making phase, which is basically usually either water spraying into a mold or water cascading down the side of a mold. Um, both of which makes a, a slight noise as the water is uh, as the water is sprayed or, or or released. And then you've got once the ice is finally formed, it drops down. Basically, it, it heats up those molds. The ice pops out and it drops down into the bin. That usually makes quite a bit of noise, and that's like a periodic noise throughout the unit use. Um, and there's not really much anybody can do about that. And then, of course, you get the whining noise of the pump whenever the pump fires up to drain out any excess um, melted ice. So all three steps, basically, of, a, of an ice maker, clear ice maker, causes noise. And there's really no way to totally and completely cancel out those noise. So every clear ice maker, and I tell customers this all the time, every clear ice maker is going to make noise. Some make a little more than others, but honestly, they all make enough noise, audible noise, that you should never put a clear ice maker in your bedroom um, because it will definitely disturb your sleep or in like a living room or an area where you're prone to kind of be relaxing and watching TV or you know it's something that you don't want to hear. In kitchens they're not usually an issue because there's always noise going on in the kitchen. You're cooking in the kitchen and in bars typically it's not an issue either. Outdoor it's rarely ever anybody complains about that. It's outside you're not ever having to deal with it but you don't want to put a clear ice maker in uh, or your living room area or place where you're living in space and also in your bedroom for sure. Um, there is some under counter ice makers that are much quieter than typical clear ice machines. Um, I'm going to talk about two different types. One is known as a crescent ice maker. Um, Uline makes one of, a, a product like this um, and has made one for quite a while. What that is is basically a typical ice maker like what you would find in a Sub-Zero refrigerator or a G refrigerator or virtually any refrigerator on the market today where it's creating um, uh, rows of ice. It drops down the ice. The ice does not melt. It is not clear ice so the ice is cloudy. Um, and the ice does not melt, it's actually held at freezing temperature. So once those ice makers fill up the bins with ice, there's no more noise. They're not creating ice anymore until you come and start taking ice out of there. They're not pumping water, so the pump noise is gone, and there's no rushing water noise on those either. So that's one good alternative if ice makers, the noise that ice makers are making is, is something that you want to avoid completely. Those are going to be the quietest. They do still make noise when they first are fired up and they start dropping ice into the bin because the ice falling into the bin makes noise. But once, they're at, uh, once they've made all the ice that they can make, the noise is pretty much done at that point. Um, the compressor kicks on and off every once in a while to hold the temp, but that really does not make uh, much noise at all. Uh, no more noise than a typical under counter refrigerator would make. Second type of um, undercounter uh, ice maker, 
that makes a lot less noise is what's known as a nugget ice machine. So this is not really a clear ice machine and it's not a crescent cube ice machine. This is the type of ice that you would get like if you went to Chick-fil-A or Sonic. Um, it's those little nuggets of ice. A lot of people find them very attractive because they're very easy to chew on. They won't hurt your teeth. Um, great product. You, right now, one of the only manufacturers making that is Scotsman, but a couple of other manufacturers are just now starting to come to market with their own nugget ice machines. They're a little bit more expensive, um, but due to their inherent design, they really don't, um, they don't cause as much noise as a clear ice machine. You still, it is, does function a little bit like a clear ice machine. Ice still melts at the bottom and is pumped out, so you still have the noise from a pump whining every time it needs to fire up. But the ice making process does not make any noise. It doesn't make any noise as it's making the ice because it's not rushing water over any kind of mold. And it's not creating noise when the ice is dropping into the bin because the cubes are extremely small and they're usually just tumbling down into a giant pile. Of, uh, of ice, so it doesn't, they, they really don't make any noise in that regard. So that's another type of undercounter ice machine if noise is really a factor that you might want to look at as well. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube video. If you'd like to be entered to win a $25 Amazon gift card, all you have to do is subscribe to our channel, give this video a like, and leave us a comment below. If you'd like to see more appliance reviews and ratings, you can head over to our blog at appliancebuyersguide.com.